morning, good morning, good morning. It's going to be a busy day, Z. I know Mimi's dad, Frank, is bringing over the big Ford tractor. Now, remember the movie Cars? Do you remember it, Z? Yes, I, I do. Okay, this is like the Maynard of tractors. Okay. It's an old Ford, but those are the best. They're big and it'll have no problem picking up our bush hog and I'll be able to mow the gator marsh mm -hmm. and the area that we cut down all the trees that the grass is getting really big mm -hmm. where we're gonna eventually put cat cages. Um, it's gonna be a fun day of mowing, more mowing and more mowing. What do you think? I think you're gonna have fun. I got a lot of little stuff to do. You got little stuff to do, but you'll have Chris here to help you too. Yeah, today. that, yeah. I know Mimi couldn't come today because she's working at the butcher. Mm -hmm. So Chris will be here, Frank will be here, and we'll get this knocked out, right guys? What could go wrong? Why did I say that? All right, now's the time to go hit the thumbs up, get back here, and let's see what we have in store today. Let's go. All right, guys, Frank brought over the uh, big old Ford. They don't make them like this anymore, Z. These were great tractors. When you're basically sitting on a giant transmission? Yeah, basically a giant motor and a tranny. Yeah. That's it. All right, we had to go get case hardened uh, shear pins. Mm hmm. Let's get this in here. That works. There's that. Let me get a socket Z and tighten this up. No, that's nice. Five eighths? No. no uh, nineteen. They're eleven sixteenths. I was saying nineteen millimeter. No, they're eleven sixteenths. Oh, that one goes in the back. That other one's already on there. Thing is, you gotta tighten these so. That way. There's no play in them. Mm -hmm. And they don't bust. If you don't tighten them, there's play, and then they just shear. All right. Let's see. Pigs just like whining today. What? Pigs just like whining today. I don't know what the trick to this one starting is. Gotta ask Frank. I don't know where Frank is. Frank. Oh, he's right there. Put it in neutral? Put it in neutral? <coughs> Why 
Which one? The right side one. You ought to be in neutral. We timed that all as we could. All we could. What? We timed that all we could. Yeah. It snapped immediately. Those aren't case hardened. Gotta go back. I gotta run back to tractor supply. Yeah. I need case hardened. We Wait. That's grade five. At least you have the video for it to show them. Uh, we picked them out, so oh, okay. there ain't no one to blame but Frank and I. Okay, I thought, you, I thought you asked for help. No, we're men, we never ask for help. Uh -huh. <laughs> Just like we never ask for directions. We can be lost for hours and still never ask for directions. That's just part, part of being a man. Okay, well have fun with that. Definitely, uh, definitely not. Hmm. I don't understand it. Because it wasn't busting the pins on the other tractor, Z, but the other tractor wouldn't lift up the back. Maybe there's two months like just power going straight to it. I don't get it because that spins easy. It's just the initial. <laughs> We can idle it down and try it. We got something to knock that one through. Yeah, another pin. It's still lined up, huh? Yep. Nope. It's not? It's not lined up, Frank? Coming right off, too. Can't get it off. Oh boy, hold on, let me spin it some. It's working. Yeah, it's spinning. It's locked in there. Yeah. 
Let me see what you can do with it. Might as well. I wonder if we have it idled down, if it starts. Let's see something. Slowly spinning it. What? It's a lot slow, but it's spinning it, yeah. Nope. No, it's just not spinning. It's what? It's not spinning at all. I know, I shut it off. But, okay. But if we idle it down and try it, at, try it again. It's Should we well, knock that one out and put a new one in? I think so. Just set it down to idling. Try and it. Try it. And get it off. I miss sliding it right off. I can't slide it right off. There's no, because it's, it's got too much of it sticking out. We'd have to knock it out. Oh, you moved it a little there. Yeah, that's why it's spinning now. Yeah, because the, the inside of the pin the is still the there. still in there. The top come off. Yeah, top yeah. and bottom came off. Mm -hmm. But the pin stuck in there, and there's enough of it sticking mm -hmm. out. To hold it. Um, all right. You know what? Work how it is. We can try it and then put another one in there if we have to. Yeah, try it. All right, let's, uh, maybe oh. you want to open that gate? I never seen a set of That's crazy. Those are harder pins than the last ones we had. Yeah, that other thing looks to me like a red Congratulations, you got the pin out. We got the pin out. Yeah. Got the pin out. Let's try a new one. One more time. Even the pigs are wondering what's going on. <laughs> yeah. I and dropped it too much, too. Yep. All right, well, Chris, blow that in here. Bring it's that not, in I here. I didn't lock it because we didn't know where to yeah. go for it. Once you get them bolts, you blame in that toolbox. Yeah. What are you guys doing around the tractor?
they just can notice that they can actually get underneath it. Did they come out of there? Yes, yeah. they're all three right there. In the back of the gravely. In the back of the. Spun it for a second, though, didn't it? Yep. Yep. They're all getting up here now. <laughs> They're walking up on the deck. Mm -hmm. Y'all crazy. Come here. <laughs> All right, that's on there. Let's see if this works. If I do it lower idle. Every come on, get get away. You guys. Nope. Hey.
Judging by the steam coming off that thing, yeah. It's hot. Yeah. Man. Were these things meant to be run that long? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, these are farm tractors, dude. They're meant to work all day. Okay, well, I didn't know because, you know. Yeah, it's a lot, of, a lot of steam. Yeah, of course it was a lot of steam. I've been running. I got chased by an alligator. Uh, chased an alligator. Chase pigs. Chase, well, the pigs don't even come near me. Now they are because you guys are in here. Yeah. And you turned it off, too. Yeah. yeah, and I turned it off. So they're like, it's safe. Let's go. Oh. I got our trail mode and all that mode and all this. So now we can till it again. Okay. You know, we can go through here with that tiller mm -hmm. and do it all. Yep. Um. And then get ready for next spring, you know? Yep. Because what do we do? We tilt it once in the winter, once in the spring, and then again in the fall. Mm-hmm. Hi, piggies. Hi, crazies. Oh, let's see if they run. <laughs> Why won't it start? Oh boy. I shouldn't have stopped, but I saw you guys. Yeah, today's just been nothing but trouble. You didn't think it would... Uh, we'll let it cool down a little bit and start it. Okay. I don't know. Um, temperature's not high. <laughs> temperature's cool. All right. Well, 
We'll see. We'll get Frank here to start it. Okay. I don't know. Chris, does this fuel gauge work? I have no clue. <laughs> <laughs> I've never used that tractor a day in my life. Oh, you haven't? No. Is it? Today is the most interaction with that tractor I've ever had. <laughs> this one's fun. It's a big old tractor. It reminds me of Maynard from Cars. Yeah. Farm equipment is definitely Frank's speciality. Mm -hmm. He knows his stuff. Yep. I'm just here for assistance. <laughs> Support? Why don't you guys get on the cart and go get Frank and... Okay. We might have to grab some more diesel and throw it in here. Yep. Be back, right back. All right, cool. Great.
broke the pen. Great. Yeah, we just saw the pins gone. What? We saw the pins gone. We picked Where it up. Right at the gate. Just finished at the gate. Really? Yep. Didn't break. Did not break. It just, just came off? Yeah. It didn't break? Nope. Go ahead, show them. Came off. Yep. Oh, it bent too. Slightly bent, but not. All right. Well, luckily it was at the very end, though. Yeah. I had no way of contacting you because you told me to hold your phone. Oh, there's the not end the thing at least. You know what? Put both of these on there. It ain't coming off that. This thing's awesome, dude. I'm yeah. telling you, it's Maynard. Frank, yeah. you gotta name this thing Maynard. What? Maynard. <laughs> this thing is so awesome. Sixteenth, I grabbed them. Is it eleven sixteenth? You said nine sixteenth. Yeah, that's what it is. You said nine sixteenth the first time, but it's eleven. I'm just gonna do like two passes in there, so we know where we're gonna cut. Okay. We're we're just gonna be setting up the trailer. Then. Okay. All right. You guys do Yep. I guess what we're staying here until you start turning it on.
<laughs> yeah, it's about time. Actually, wait. Hold on. I got a weight test. I got a weight to test. I said I got a weight to test. Let's see if it's level. What? I have a weight to test. Oh, the level? Yeah, to see if it's level. I think it looks level. Yep. Like one You're off, right. but good enough. Right. Need staying behind this thing.
the audience over in the rodents. All right, we got that undone. Next time he brings it over, we'll mow that. Uh oh. Starter fluid, brake fluid. Now, Frank, yes. what do we, we have to uh, mow that and then we have to till it. So I'll have to have you bring your big disc because I got to get it leveled so that I can have the rock guys come dump rock and raise it. And at the hole. Okay. Oh, oh. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Get gas. We run out of fuel, didn't we? No way. No way. There's any left in that gas can? No. I'm like, no way. No. It's a I diesel. Like it don't use. Been, it. I put ten gallons in it. Yeah, diesel don't use that much fuel. No, they don't. I don't know why it ain't running though. <laughs> Spray it, Z. Wait. Wait. Is it because all the stuff here? No. You want those back tires right between the two tires, right? <laughs> That's the way I always do. No, I had it a little bit too back too far. Uh oh, up. did it get wrapped up underneath there? Z guy. Next time we come, we need to bring the disc. Yeah, I don't know, Frank. What do you think? We we got to do the bush hog. We bush hog that, right. and then my idea was to disc that all up so. It, if we disc it a couple times, it'll level out. This plow and then disc. Yeah. We plow it and then disc it. That'll level it off. Do you it's have the plow? Huh? Do you have the plow for that? Yeah. All right. Let's. Next time we'll plow it. We'll finish mowing what that. You can do it, bring it over here. And where I can leave it one week. Right. You can do what you got to do. Yeah. yeah. But you're better at that. I'm an amateur when it comes to that. We all start somewhere. That's true. That's true. I'm good with backhoes and... Well, you're good with the hose, huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Well, the gator marsh is all mowed. Now we do have to mow all that area where the cat cages are. Finish moving these telephone poles. And then we're going to have to start using the telephone poles up uh which is a good thing problem to have um right in there in the middle is going to be a castleberry cage so i want to build the castleberry cage put the poles around it for that and i want to level out the inside 
and then we can plant it and that way stuff will grow for the cassowaries to be able to hide. All right, now we gotta get working on this as soon as Scooter gets back up here. Get Kevin Isaac out here, knock this out. It should only take us a couple days. All right, if we have a lot of help, it'll only take us a couple days. But that tree branch over there, I gotta cut down. Put the perimeter fencing up and we're good. We're golden and then just build the cages inside and build the deck on top of there. And then cut those poles so they're good. All right, coming along in the goat pen up front. Oh my goodness, so much to do. All right, well, I'm gonna help do this and we'll get back to you. Wow, all right, we got the tractor loaded, tied down. Frank is on his way. I gotta tell you, um, Mimi, her mom, her dad, and Raw Dog are a true blessing. So, so helpful and I am so grateful and I know Z is so grateful for mm -hmm. it. Amazing people, truly amazing people. And um, it's just, I got the whole Gator Marsh mode. I got some of this mode, Z, and in two weeks he's gonna bring it back out. We're gonna finish mowing that. He's gonna bring out the plow. Yep. We'll plow it, that levels it. And then we'll see how many, how much loads of rocks. We're gonna hit up um, Florida rock and sand, sand and rock, or, and see if they'll donate to the 501c3 so we can build that area up. Yep. So it doesn't flood at all. And then we can build the big cat cages back there in the future. And then the cassowary cage will go over there. We got to level around there and fix it up and start planting trees in there for them. So they start growing. And uh, what are you guys doing? Hey. Hi, Jupies. What are you eating, Jupies? Food. Food. Hi, Zabu. Hey, look. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. Come here. Come here. You don't have to be so mean. I know. She's in heat, so you're going to be mean. You're going to be all crazy. She'll be mean, too. She'll have and her she'll moments. be mean to you. She'll have her moments. She just wants the camera. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. When you want to be. <laughs> now quit being a jerk. When you want to be good, you can be. Then you can be a good boy. Aw, Zabu. Hi, buddy. Hi. Oh, your ballies are swollen big. They're big and swollen. I know. You just want to breathe. You just want to breathe. Stop. No. See? See how he is? He tricks you. He's real nice. And then... <laughs> but she is a sweetheart. No, she just goes straight into the mood. <laughs> Instead mm -hmm. of, you know, lulling you to a fence. Yeah. If when she's when she's being evil, she straight away evil. She doesn't lull you in. Yeah. If she's doing this, she's a sweetheart. Yep. If she's coming at you with her teeth, they like chatter. Yeah. Then she's being she's like, leave me alone. Yep. Oh, you're so good. You're such a good girl. You are such a good girl. I love you. All right. Well. I got other things I got to get to and do. Z's got stuff he's got to yeah. do. He's got to go feed the lemurs up front. Uh, I got to go help Cass feed the birds. And then we got to feed the rabbits and the goat. Yep. And then uh, eat dinner. And then later tonight we do the kinkachoos and the uh, yep. rats. Yep. All right. That means... I hope you guys had an incredible day. We got a lot done today. And as soon as Scott gets back here, we'll try to arrange it so we have 
Kevin and Isaac here and a couple of their guys, and we'll knock that out. Kevin called me and said, well, how long do you think it'll take us to do if we're a bunch of us there? If oh. I said, if there's a bunch of us, three days. It might, it might have to be next week. That's the problem. It'll have to be next week. Yeah. It won't be this week. Because, yeah, because this week's Thanksgiving. Yeah, that's why I'm saying. And that's why I, I wasn't. Yeah, it'll have to be week after. I wasn't trying to burst your bubble there. No, but... I, I know. Yeah. I know. Okay. Wednesday's my birthday, and then. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is Thursday, and all, all kinds of stuff. But right now, make sure you smash that like button, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That way, when we do post new videos, we will put them up. And uh, weather permitting and everything, we'll keep putting out videos so you guys enjoy them and learn new things oh man that's gonna be that's gonna be awesome that's gonna be jupes and uh zabu cage right there the big one see? yep it'll be 10 feet tall yep and then we'll have a deck on top of there mm -hmm. just for like you and me and yep. scott employees we can sit up there and uh inside the lemur pen then the ring tails ring tails ring tails then the kinkachus, kinkachus, and we'll put a couple other cages for future uh, lemurs and small primates. We'll go in that area, mm -hmm. like squirrel monkeys yep. and capuchin monkeys and the lemurs. Actually, you know what? We might just keep that to lemurs and kinkachus. Fair. Because we're still going to get brown lemurs and we're still going to get the red rough lemurs. Yeah. And not to mention, uh, capuchins are pretty evil. Uh, it's uh, we need a lot of people for capuchins. Capuchins aren't that bad, really. It's oh, just, I thought I thought capuchins could be evil. They can be. Yep. They really can be, but they're small and they're handle. They're easy to deal with. Okay. Uh, it's just when you're trying to take a baby away. Okay. But I don't like taking babies Fair. away. You know yeah. that. I don't Fair. take babies away till they're weaned, because then they end up nicer adults. Once they're weaned, you can still, you're still working with them like we do the lemurs. Mm -hmm. Our baby lemurs grow up to be a friendly. Yep. You know, we only have really Mort that's a total a hole. Yeah. And that's because he was bottle raised. He was pulled from the mom at two days old and bottle raised. Oh, man. All right. Guys, once again. Love you, get swamped, and share your passion, random acts of kindness. It goes a long way. It makes the world a much better place, and Lord knows we need that right now. We need it every day, really. So, see ya. Right, I'm out of here, Z. I'm going up front to do my stuff. Yep. See ya. See ya.